Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, that uh, grill finally came in. So that's one of the things we will do in this video. We will get that grill uh, ready to go on the car, then put on the car. Then uh, we also have a little lip spoiler we will be uh, putting on that I ordered. So uh, we'll take a look at that after we get uh, started on this uh, grill. Alright guys, so the grill came in and uh, as you can see I'm going to need to uh, get a finish on it. It's just kind of flat black right now. Um, yeah, the holes on top are pre-drilled. Um, on this one as you can see on the back side however they are not so all these tabs uh, here and here and here and the one on the end there those will have to be drilled um, so that you can secure the bottom to the car so I'm going to uh, drill those out and then wet sand this so I can get a good finish on it uh, before we get it on the car all right, so the holes are drilled on the back now. So I'm gonna uh, use this little bit of water I got in the bathtub here and some sandpaper and give it a quick wet sand uh, before I clean it off again. And then we'll take it outside and uh, put the first coat of paint on it. All right, I have it all wet sanded now. Um, have it sitting out here, so it'll dry completely off um, before I get it prepped paint. So we'll let it sit out here to um, dry. Uh, I did, these were the screws that were gonna be used for the original grill. So that's what I'll be using on this one. Um, that's why I picked the bit I did when I drilled the holes to make sure that these would fit nice and snug inside the grill and uh, hold it tightly to the car so it didn't like rattle around and stuff. But um, yeah, so this is just gonna sit out here for a little bit. And uh, then we'll come back and grab it later and uh, wipe it back down and get to painting. All right, now as you see here, it's, uh, you can see it's scuffed and dull and you can see some of the, uh, the white showing through the black now that it's uh, been sanded. So uh, we'll get this thing put uh, away from the car and uh, on something so we don't get spray paint everywhere. And uh, we'll get a nice, even, light coat to go over it the first time. Make sure it sets well, completely dries. And then we'll, uh, we'll start working on some, uh, some more coats on it. Alright, we got the uh, first real light coat on there. Uh, just to give it a base. We're going to let that completely dry uh, for uh, probably till tomorrow. I'm going to let it go ahead and sit and completely uh, get stuck on there. And then uh, in the morning, I'll... Uh, check it out and uh, throw a little bit of sandpaper on it if I need to and put another coat and then uh, we'll layer on the coats after that all right guys um, while the paint's drying on that uh, grill we're gonna get the lip spoiler out of the box here and uh, get it in place with a couple self-tapping screws and um, obviously we got to get the uh, car off the ground put it on some jack stands first uh, then after I get it, I got some uh, nuts and bolts here I'm going to use. I got the, the rounded head ones just so they don't grab on stuff quite as easy. And put a washer on the nut side and secure it with those so it doesn't go anywhere. Alright, the car is now off the ground. I'm going to use the self-tapping screws, like I said, just to get this uh, put in place. And we'll drill some holes out and uh, secure it with the nuts and bolts. Alright guys, just to give you an idea, and this is what it looks like on the uh, bottom side. It's got the uh, round bolts here with the nuts on top, just to uh, keep it snug. So, um, this is done so far. And, uh, ooh, trying not to fall down here. And that is how the uh, lip looks on there. Now I just got to clean it up from all the dust and handprints and stuff but um yeah that's how that's sitting now we'll uh, finish up with the grill all right so i do have the final coat on the grill um that's been drying for a while now um 
So now we're gonna go ahead and get it on the car. To start, we're gonna go ahead and take out um, these again, just to give us a little bit more um, play, getting the screws and stuff back in the uh, grill. So we'll get that pulled up, get this wing kind of pull it away some, and um, then we'll get it seated so we can get the um, screws down in the bottom in their spots so it'll uh, sit nice and flush. All right, and before we get the grill on, we'll go ahead and put the uh, new STI badge on there. I went and got a new one. The other one was pretty faded. So we'll get it stuck on. I'll put the backing plate on it, and then um, we will get this thing on. All right, guys, it's uh, grill is on. Lip spoiler is on. Uh, I just got to clean them up now. Got all my, my dirty fingerprints all over them. But, uh, yeah, so there, finally the uh, somewhat finished. Got the grill, got the lip spoiler, and the fog light bezels all done. So I can wrap this one up. As always, thanks for uh, tuning in and watching. Please like and subscribe. Check out mine and Corey's personal pages. Uh, we're trying to get those kind of going again. Um, but, uh, yeah, thanks. We'll see you next time.